34, 35. Oh, hey, I actually do this all the time, but some people would say I work out too much. And I'm actually part of the 23% of all Americans that get enough daily exercise. I'd stop. So I want to clarify something real quick. In this article from Popular Science, only 23% of all United States adults actually get that 150 minutes of aerobic exercise. And that's not a lot of adults. But head back to him. Hi, I'm Jordan Pearl, and today I'm gonna to be talking to you guys about why you should be working out more and living a healthier lifestyle. Do you guys ever feel yourself not having enough endurance? You can't play basketball with your kid anymore without completely running out of breath? Is your strength just not up to what it used to be. You can't carry groceries in from the store like you used to. Or your balance and your flexibility is just totally out of whack. Do you ever feel like you're not in control of your own weight? Well, today we're gonna to talk about three important factors of maintaining a healthy lifestyle. Number one, we're gonna have daily exercise. Number two, healthy eating. And number three, maintaining that routine. First, we're gonna talk about some daily exercises. Number one, wake up early in the morning and take your dog for a 20 to 30 minute walk. That'll get your blood pumping and burn a little bit of those calories. Number two, you can set yourself a schedule so that every night you go to the gym for an hour to an hour and a half. Or number three, create a fun family activity almost every night so that way your family can have fun and also have some exercise while you're at it. Secondly, we're going to talk about some more healthy eating habits. Number one, you want to eat more because eating more actually speeds up your metabolism. Your metabolism is going to metabolize foods faster if your body's trying to ingest those ingredients more. So. We're gonna eat more fruits, we're gonna eat some more veggies, low fat milks, whole grain. We're also gonna to stick to more of the, the leaner meats and also poultry, fish, and things like eggs, beans, and nuts. All right, I'm gonna stop you one more time, but there's actually a good chart on dailynutrition.com that actually shows your monthly, your weekly, and your daily breakdown of what you should be eating on a daily basis so that way you can control your weight gain and keep your daily healthy eating routine in check. All right, well, let's get back to him. We also wanna stay away from the more things that are saturated in fat and things with high amounts of sugar or sodium. And to combat that, instead of using your regular seasonings, they make things that actually have less salt or actually have no salt in them. Now, and thirdly, we're going to talk about how to maintain that healthy lifestyle. Now that you have a daily exercise routine, you have daily eating, healthy daily eating habits you're living that healthy lifestyle, you're gonna wanna drink lots of water, you're gonna wanna limit the amount of sugary snacks that you intake throughout the day, and substitute those with fruits, or veggies, or even a protein bar. You also wanna make sure that you're maintaining or reducing the amount of body weight that you have. And thirdly, make sure you're always drinking lots and lots of water. And with all of these steps combined, you can start your own path to a healthier lifestyle and ditch all of that weight and negative self-esteem to the curb. Now, get out there and show the world what you're made of.